let's continue the analysis of cpk 2021 chemistry question paper this is a direct question answer is right sp3d then in kanizaro reaction benzoyl here is converted to benzoyl alcohol and benzoic acid this is again a direct question so these are permanent gases, direct question. So the void space in simple cubic lattice in percentage is, so Sarla Ganam down the Kali Pradeshan, the Chedan Kintante, we use the packing fraction. Usual ga, So packing fraction in uh, simple cubic lattice is around 52%. So 52%. So then rest will be void. That is calibration. 100 minus 52 is around 48%. That means 47.6. This is the correct answer. So 100 minus. to approximately 48 percent 48 percent is the void so therefore that is the answer so this is based on aromaticity and anti-aromaticity and the non-aromaticity so which will be highly reactive in hydrolysis. That means upon hydrolysis, all these will get up. They give carbocations. Look at here. If you can get the carbocation is here, so you will get this is going to be anti-aromatic species. So this is phenyl carbocation, which is not at all stable. Here, this is tropelium cation, which is aromatic that prefers to be formed. So therefore, naturally, this could be the answer. So the stability order will be aromatic, greater than non-aromatic, which is further greater than anti-aromatic. This ammonia is ammonia basically, if you can write, you can write like this. Basically, it is a pyramidal molecule. Okay. Yes, you can. Write this way also, otherwise. Just for the purpose of synon renal molecule. So it will have it will have one C3. Then have one sigma V, another sigma V. Another sigma that is vertical axis. Simply, you can say three planes of symmetry. So, therefore, C3 plus three sigma v that is Cn plus n sigma v equals to that is equals to Cnv point group. So, therefore, it is C3v point group. I'll look at Cn plus n C v will give you so Cnv point group. So therefore, C3 plus 3 sigma V will result in C3V point group. Ammonia molecule belongs to C3V point group. So this will undergo rearrangement basically. So if you can look at here. So first you will get this 
will get a carbocation, which is a primary carbocation. This rearranges to a tertiary carbocation. So here you will get what is known as formatium will be attacked. So this is going to be the final product. So look at here, yes, this is the answer. I mean, this uh, will undergo hydrolysis, we will give you the corresponding alcohol. So that, that will give you the corresponding alcohol. So your answer is good. this is right. So with the rearrangement, you are going to get this one, right? Not this one. This is a direct question 2.5. Learn me over if you want and show the yes. this is most linear at low pressures. So therefore, this is the long equation. So naturally. At low pressures, the rate of absorption is linearly proportional, that is linear almost. See, in Wittig reaction, what is Wittig reaction basically? Between a carbonyl compound and some phosphorus elite. So there is a double bond formation. This is what is known as a Wittig reaction. This is known as Wittig reaction. So therefore, C double bond C is formed. It's a very important name of reaction. Uh, this is again direct question. This is an exception. Usually, this is the best option. Why? Because if you take the other way, this will become this will give an elimination product. This will give an elimination product. These two are not at all concerned. Basically, say Williamson synthesis, but this will give an elimination product. So, whenever you want to prepare a tertiary butyl and some other alkyl ether, you need to take tertiary butoxide as the alkyl oxide, the other should be alkyl halide. Now, this is again a direct question. This is a also a direct question. Yeah, this is again a direct question. 656 nanometer, 6562 six uh, angstroms. This angstroms, 652 nanometers. So here, uh, as you have studied in your regular class, so all these will not ionize. We have more number of particles. Basically, colligative properties directly proportional to the number of particles. So it depends upon the number of particles. Even don't bother about this one. So you'll get this will ionize into two species each in say formula. So this will be one. So naturally, this is going to more number of particles, more colligative property. But the osmotic pressure is more, the pressure in so like that, any other. Averaging point is more elevation in boiling point or any what you call as colligative property that yeah, depends upon the number of particles, the direct conduct. So, more equatorial bonds. So, particularly the bulky group must be uh, present in equatorial position, but here in the other methyl group is an axial position. We have uh, one three diaxial interactions. But this is less stable when compared to this. There are no interactions. The equatorial position of the least interactions with the equator. So, this is the most stable confirmed. So, this is a direct question. Uh, then, milk is an emulsion. Again, direct question. If you could have anti aromatic, uh, again, direct. If you anti aromatic, aromatic, aromatic. This is non aromatic. We put a direct question. This is the right. Then naturally, the uh, this uh, what you call as absolute configuration is nothing to do with the uh, what you call as the 
uh, rotation. Specific rotation is experimental value, and this is the absolute configuration is assigned based on the, the relative orientation of the other groups. So therefore, so it could be LIGO or it could be dextra. You cannot correlate actually. So configuration could not be correlated with the optical rotation. So lithium. So. Usually, even other alkali metals also can give, but uh, this will be more. But this is an ambiguous question, basically. So, even though lithium is correct, but even alkali metals, most of the alkali metals will, I will give uh, amide formation of them, but uh, you could take uh, amide. So, yes, I think uh, I'm not sure about this one. It has to be listed. Let us write the balance of equation. So if you can write the balance of equation, so it comes out to be like this. K2 plus 6 plus 4, 7 plus 2 plus 4, 4 will give you 3 F2. So for yes, CR2 chromium, that is CR2 is for four plus. So don't worry about this one. This comes out to be six moles. This will be equals to one mole, six moles. So formula is M1 V1 by M1 is equals to M2 V2 by N. You calculate M1 is given, V1 is given, N1 is given. M2 is given, I think, uh, I know, M2 you need to find out. Yes, so this is not given, you can go on, 10 into 5 into 2 divided by 1 is equals to X into V2 is 12 divided by 6, number of moles, 6 to 0. If you can bring this set, it will be, you need this current. So, I put in my term in the divide just the 0 0.0 0, 0 0.01 into 10 will be equal to 0 0.1. That's right. So, okay, so this is the balance of the equation. The Aldal is a very famous reaction. The Vikuda, the Munam, the Rindo, the Chest, the Monkey, the Methana, and the Chest, the Vikuda. But this methane on the Aldal, so barium carbide, aluminum carbide, the Rindo, the Chest, the Monkey. This is again direct question. Phosphorus, um, silicon with phosphorus, negative type, and type. So, trifluoristic acid is the simplest electron based on the electronic effects, easily. Then, the intent of the monkey, visual specific, and also less substituted alcohol, which is the So, double bond economy, less substituted alcohol. This one. So, highly regious uh, selective, the monkey, diagonal. The direct question. The elimination method of the Then the direct question LF63 minus. If you could have direct question, it can only non equal solvents was taken. If you could have monkey, first ticket in Tante, you will get secondary alcohol, isopropyl alcohol, which is the Grignard reagent alcohol, Jones reagent, Tomal Pimpente, specific reagent, chromium reagent. If the monkey alcohols to all the head ketone stages law, you put them, you will get isopropyl alcohol, then you have the Grignard reagent 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 so dissolved, it will be uh, dissolved, it could be dissolved in benzene. Then this is cyclohexane. Many students uh, uh, ask this one, the cyclopentane is more stable. Cyclopentane is more stable according to Bayer's strain theory. But if you can look at the confirmations, cyclohexane is not having any type of strain. So cyclohexane is more stable. So there is no uh, doubt about that one. So permanganate, what exactly happens is Cl minus will be what you call as oxidase to Cl2. 
So in a say quantitative redox reaction, quantitative analysis that may interfere with the calculation. So therefore, HCl will not be used for SD question of permanganate. If you want to SD5, you need to take sulfuric acid. Even nitric acid is also not used. But this is the actual uh, one. If you want, that could be this. That is the rated of uh, what is called as Milan space, it is called so NH2 HG O HG I. This is actually comes out to be this one HG O HG NH2 I. So that is the right answer. So, direct question, cell cell only here, right? So, you could have direct question. I have seven hydrolysis, H5, such memory based. I uh, could have direct question, memory based again. It could have LN plus three gravity. This is the formula, right? ICL is used to quantitatively determine the C double bond six carbon carbon double bonds. This uh, interhalogen compound is used. Helium will not be adsorbed. So even in plus two interlocal room to make it. So that will escape at all temperatures. So the mirror direct change and vanadium, for example, if you take an OPD, one or two, this work out JCM. So it's the name titanium vanadium. And get this thing. Vanadium 23, 20 scandium, titanium vanadium. Okay. So D3 is two. So basically it has three unpaid electrons. In plus two oxidation state, these electrons will go again same magnetic moment. Even vanadium plus two state also it will have so same number of unpaid electrons. Like that, you can calculate. You will get the correct answer. It is chromium, right? You can work out later. So the order of uh, free radical halogenation is, this you have studied in alkyl chapter, free radical substitution 3 0 greater than 2 0 greater than. Yeah. So, therefore, so here you are going to get the tertiary free radical. So, naturally, that's going to be the major product. So, therefore, that is going to be the major product. So, where the carbon at which Br will be. Attacked. So this is again direct question. Some area. Direct question. If it is so basically, I think this is again uh, option is uh, not there. In fact, one pentadiene is also not optically active. So I think this question needs to be challenged. So this is one pentadiene. So I don't think this will exhibit optical activity. No other compound, even uh, cis. This is also having plain of cement. So therefore, we will not. Mesotartaric acid as such, it is optically inactive. But this could be challenged. No answer. This is wrong. So that's it. So this is something about uh, the uh, CPK 2021 question paper, and it looks to be very simple. And I think the margin will, I mean, difference will be very less between two different lines. Anyway, wish you all the best to all of you. Thank you very much.